is Reese's. Always Reese's. Everything is Reese's. Life is Reese's. Okay. What if Hey, I missed you all day while you were tagged for the Halloween tag by Andy and Tay. So we are going to try to quickly film this Why? Why Amelia sleeps, but you might hear her wrestling around a little bit. Okay. There are 15 questions. Josh has not heard these questions, so if he takes a little longer to answer, that's why. Um, number one, what is your favorite part of Halloween? Uh, I would say cosplay conventions. Oh, cosplay conventions. Uh, except I've never been to one. <laughs> so the idea of cosplay conventions. Yeah. My favorite part used to be candy, for sure, because I'm a candy person. But now I think it's dressing up Amelia because it's so fun and she's so cute. Okay, number two. What was When was the last time that you took or treated? Like, what age were you when you stopped trick or treating? Uh, the year before uh, the Blair Witch Project came out. What? How do you remember that? Because uh, that's the first year I didn't go trigger treating. Did you stay home and watch the Blair Witch Project? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. What age do you think you were? No idea. Okay. I think I was like 16 probably. Like whenever I could start to buy my own candy. I think that's what Andy and Tay said too. Like when I could buy my own candy. But I will admit I'm pretty excited to have Amelia like when she's older because then I get to go trick or treating again. And I might take her trick or treating this year and then just eat her candy because she can't eat it. Okay. It's like, what is your favorite Halloween candy, and what is your favorite all-time candy? It's two different questions. Uh. Because you don't get some candies. Jawbreakers. For Halloween candy or regular candy? For Halloween candy. I've never seen you eat a Jawbreaker. It's because I'm not. Uh, okay, go ahead. Uh, all-time favorite. Reese's. Ferrero Rocher. Oh yeah, that's true. My favorite Halloween candy. I think it's like those flavored Tootsie Rolls because I never get them anytime besides trick or treating. You know, like the vanilla ones and they're blue no, and stuff. Is. Oh, um, that's my favorite Halloween candy. And then my favorite regular candy is Reese's. Always Reese's. Everything is Reese's. Life is Reese's. Okay. What is your costume this year? I don't think we've made any plans. For that. I don't know what I'm gonna be. What are you gonna be? I'm gonna be Little Red Riding Hood because I have the costume, but I'm gonna be mauled like. Like I got attacked. I'd like it if you were a wolf, but you probably won't be. Well, so what's Yuki gonna be? Yuki has like fifteen costumes, but for Halloween itself, I think she's gonna be a little lamb. And I was gonna be a little Bo Peep, but I don't have the um, costume, and I'm not gonna make it. I know myself. I. You'd probably be an army guy. I could do that. Yeah. 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 I'll probably be. An you army could guy. be an army guy, and I could be a zombie, like that. I was shot. Like you <sighs> shot me. Okay. Anyway. We have lots of ideas, if you didn't notice. Okay, um, what was your favorite costume you've ever worn? Has he looked uh, at the camera this whole time? Uh, yeah, he hasn't looked I've at the camera. <laughs> <laughs> okay, favorite costume of all time? Uh, I was the white Power Ranger one year. Which one's that? Is that a good one? From the original Power Rangers. Oh. Um, I really liked, I did a zombie Marilyn Monroe. Um, when I worked at Walmart and I got to wear it to work and I really liked that but last year I did the zipper face and It was really cool. And We went downtown and people were like legit scared of me And liked it. So that was pretty fun. I really liked that too, but I've always liked my Halloween costumes um, Your least favorite Halloween costume you've ever worn or had to wear Did your parents ever put you in a bad uh, costume? Yeah, this well my mom never really had a lot of money growing up so she put uh, she made my brother's costumes a couple years and one year uh, we were both a pair of dice. It was like the box? It was she Can't be as bad as my mom. <laughs> my mom made us raisins one year with trash bags. We wore trash bags. Um, That's almost as bad. I think all my least favorite costumes were any time that I wasn't allowed to be something like scary and gory because my mm -hmm. mom thought we were like little girls and didn't want to do that but I've always liked the scarier part of Halloween and I hope Amelia does too. I mean I'll be kind of disappointed if she wants to be a princess like every year. I think it would be pretty kick-ass if she, like, wants to be, like, Leatherface. <laughs> that would be so awesome to me. Okay. Um, do you plan on going into any haunted houses or corn mazes this year? Uh, yeah, we have 
tickets. We won tickets to a Twisted Forest, and then we might go to the corn maze, but it's during the day at the pumpkin patch, and we go get our pumpkins. There's a corn maze there. It's like $2, so I bet we end up doing that. Okay. Have you always loved Halloween, or did you dislike it as a child? I've always loved Halloween. I've, I've never... I don't like being cold, because my feet always get real cold and start to hurt, but... Uh, I've always loved it. At Halloween? Mm -hmm. Are you not wearing shoes usually? No, I'm usually wearing shoes. <laughs> Just because you're outside so long, you yeah. mean? Um, yeah, I think I've always loved Halloween. I went to a small school, so we were allowed to dress up for school. I think they're not allowed to dress up at schools anymore, which is really sad to me. And we did like a big Halloween parade at my school, so I love Halloween since I can remember. Um, one of my favorite holidays, definitely. Okay, do you usually buy or make your costume? I uh, usually buy it this year. Well, I guess this year counts as buying it too since I already have this stuff. I don't think I've ever actually bought like a costume. I bought like pieces to costumes, but I almost always just make my stuff. Like my Marilyn Monroe was my sister's bridesmaid dress from her wedding and you know, I just like to make it. I think it's just better when you make it, personally. Amelia! Um, what is your favorite Halloween TV special? Um, I don't know. question. Like, you mean like an episode of a show? I guess it'd be the 13 Days of Halloween that all the networks usually do. Yeah, I like it. And I like, um, Anytime Freddy Krueger's. But it's TV. just a montage of horror movies. I love that. Okay. That was a hard question. Um, favorite type of monster? Zombies, vampires, witches, ghosts. I don't say zombies. Uh, no, it's not my favorite. Actually, you like werewolf movies and stuff. Um, I would say the kind that comes from games. They're usually more, much more creative and much more in depth. But the Halloween in monsters. They could be if somebody were to make it. Okay, I like zombies. I like the idea of zombies. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go with zombies. What is your favorite Halloween movie? The next question is scary movie. So the first one has to be Halloween. Movie. Uh, Trick or Treat. We bought that. A it was good. couple years ago, and it was really good. We need to watch that this year. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to have to go with Nightmare Before Christmas. That's a Halloween movie, and I love all things Tim Burton, so I'm going to go with Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, that's what I'm going to go with. Um, favorite scary movie of all time? Um, favorite scary movie, or one that scares me the most? Do both. Uh, favorite scary movie? I don't know, I'll just think on that. You go first. Um... My favorite scary movies, like, I love, I just love Freddy Krueger. I think, I don't know if I was exposed to him, like, at a, you know, like a younger age, and so I've loved him, like, uh, he's always been my favorite. Um, but I think my favorite scary movie, which it's a terrible movie, so if you've never seen it, don't, like, watch it and think it's going to be a good movie, but I loved Freddy vs. Jason, just because it was both of them, and I've always loved both of those people, but the movie, the movie that scares me the most is It because my sisters made me watch it when I was way too little and I've been scarred by it for life. For life. That's, that's a good answer. Yeah. It? Yeah. Yeah, I've always, yeah, I think everyone who watched it as a child is scarred like, by it. Like, no one should ever watch it as a child. Um, I don't really have a favorite screen movie. I, li I like most of them except slasher movies. Yeah, you probably like just like the zombie movies. Yeah, I say almost any zombie movie. You don't have a favorite that you can think of? No. Okay. But it scared you the most? It's definitely one of them that scared me the most. The one that scared me the most, there's three movies that scared me the most. Okay. It, uh, one of them is called The Gate. I think it was made in okay, the 80s. And, it, She's you sleeping. Know, she makes those noises in her sleep. Nowadays, it's, it's effects aren't great. Uh, but back in the day, <laughs> that was a scary movie. And it, I had nightmares in that movie forever. Uh, um, and the other one is The Grudge. I was going to say, I watched The Grudge. We were probably what? You were probably 14. I don't know what you were talking about. Or older. About, so. I don't know either. But like, I watched The Grudge, and I was scared of something crawling up my bed for the longest time. You know when it's like under her covers? Mm -hmm. I was scared of that for the longest time. But again, I just think I watched that too young. The Grudge like, 2 was really good too, and then uh... The Grudge 3 sucked. The Grudge 3 is Is that the one with all the deer? Grudge 3? Attacked her car, or was that 2? Whatever one that one yeah. was, sucked. Okay. Um... 
through 14 is what are your plans for this Halloween? We kind of wing it. I don't really know. Like, it's hard because Amelia is not old enough to go trick or treating, but at the same time, I want her to do something. We live in an apartment complex. The first year that we lived here, we went over to Walmart and we bought like $50 worth of candy. We were so excited to have our own place and thought we were going to have all these trick or treaters. And we ate all of it because we didn't have one trick-or-treater. I yeah. guess trick-or-treaters just don't come to apartment complexes, which well, was fine. not even the kids that live here in the complex. Yeah, come which here. I would think that would be like a decent place. Like, you have all these doors. You don't have to like get in and out of your car, but no one came. So, I don't know. I think this Thursday or Friday, this is news to Josh. I don't tell him anything ahead of time. We might be going to Spooktacular at the zoo here, which is kind of like a trick-or-treating at the zoo. And we'll probably just end up hanging out with one set of our nieces and nephews um, because... They're at the age where it's more fun to see them. All right, last question. What is your all-time favorite Halloween decoration? Um, probably those guys that sit on the porch disguised as, like, strong or something and then scare the crap out of people when they come up. That's super cute. I like, um, I love inflatable things. Like, I love all the inflatables, but I think my favorite is just scarecrows in general because... I'm just kind of like freaked out by scarecrows, and they make me think about Jeepers Creepers. She the loudest sleeping baby you've ever heard. Like, she's asleep right now. Her eyes are closed. But, okay, that was all of our questions. Um, I'm not sure who we'll tag. We'll tag them down below here. Josh has no idea who we would tag. But, um, thanks so much again to Andy and Tay for tagging us. And uh, if you haven't seen their tag video yet, click right right here somewhere um, and watch their Halloween tag because they had really good answers too. Right over my head? Right. Yeah. Like here. as a halo. That's going to be their <laughs> click. Okay. Bye guys. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Thanks, Steve.